Oh, we'll stop revolving before we go all the way around and end up back where we started. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is a typo. No, it's just a really good pun. Um, or I don't know if it's a pun, but some sort of wordplay. But the struggle can be protected. So we can take some money, we can get a random blueprint. I'm gonna take the revolutionary immigrants uh, because more people is handy so that we can have more workers and stuff. Although you can see the freighters are coming in. We're making some money and we're getting some new immigrants as well. But having revolutionaries, I think will help us when we try to declare independence from the crown. We think I have a bar already next to the house and graveyard. We have a graveyard? It's whiskey and chocolate. Whiskey and chocolate from Colonel Cola. Hey, uh, I feel like Tropico is basically the same as five. Oh, six is the same as five. Even the advisors sound the same, kind of bummed out. Well, the problem is if it was too different, that would be a bad thing. Like, and and you know, we've, we've seen that before. There have been switches in some of the advisors. There was the switch with two. A lot of us want more of the same. I know it's like a little weird to say. Oh, there's a tavern. And it looks like we can't rename it, but cool man, we will know that this is your tavern over here. We know this is you. Work mode, liquid melancholy, or all you can drink. Decreases job quality by 10, but efficiency is increased. All you can drink! Whiskey and ah, it's whiskey and chocolate from rainwater! Oh, that's a big message. I'm gonna have to tab to the other thing. Having revolution is great when the people are upset. Well, this is not, this is not rebels. Are you a rebel? This is not rebels. These are revolutionaries, which will help us overthrow the, uh, the colonial government, the crown, and instill us as the true El Presidente over here. So who is it? Rainwater. I've been watching your channel since Civ 5 was first released. 2010. Jesus. Has it really been that long? I mean, I guess it must have been. Oof. I love your videos and watch them almost daily. Keep up the good work. I'd love to see you play The Neverhood sometime in the future. It's a great game I think you'll enjoy. I will add that to my list of things to uh, consider. Thank you very much for the suggestion. Always open to suggestions. Appreciate it muchly. Boom. Eight years, yeah. Miss Penultimo, I know. <laughs> oh, a task update or... Oh, new task. But might I make a tiny suggestion? Too many unemployed citizens. Yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll do that. I know, yeah. So deactivate guidance task. So this is not a real mission. This is just pointing out, hey, uh, you might not want to suck so much. I'm like, oh, okay. So can we start industrial stuff? We could. Now, this is gonna, all we're going to require educated people, I think. So I don't think that's the right route. Um, not yet, but let's, how about we consider a school? There's the circus, uh-huh. More taverns. Oh, we can build the library already. Did we research it? I'm confused. Let's get a library. We can recruit some, some educated people to come and work there. Looks like that's the front that way. Um... We can get a grocery store to help distribute the food. Let's put it right here near the farms. And, uh, oh no, we have a chapel already. That's fine. A dungeon? Oh, baby! So we can arrest people. Yeah, let, let's wait on that, a scooch. Teamster's office versus Teamster's port. Transport goods to the other islands. Oh! In between our little archipelago. I see. So, can we mine? Yeah, we got a mine over here. What is this, coal? Yeah. So it needs to be placed on the deposit. Okay. There was always the lack of clarity before of like, oh my god, I'm all red. Look how pink I am from the screen. That's amazing. Oh my god. All right. So I think I'm going to continue this straight for another block and then sort of angle off as a curve that, you know, might go and do something else. Whiskey and chocolate from Katie. Best part of Quill is... Oh, hold on. The best part Quill... Oh, for Tropico. Uh, is a keep release in the same game. Games would... Bitch, they never innovate. Yeah, okay, it's always a problem, right? It's, it's sort of lose-lose. If you release basically the same game, then yeah, it's the same game and I'm paying for the same game and they never innovate. Um, 
and if they change things and people complain, they change. It's very, I mean, and the fact of the matter is, there's multiple different people, so some group of people will always, you can't please everyone all the time. That's, that's one of the things for sure. Can I sneak that in there? I think it, oh. Ah, we did lose some of our farming plots. Still, I okay, think that's fine. So set up the mine over there. You have a pirate code, you need to run the distillery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or otherwise people will start revolving. <laughs> okay, so, yes, raid screen. Ooh. We have 1,422 raid points for whatever that means. Loot bananas, iron. Oh, so it's 2,000 to do this raid for six months in search of flotsam. Okay, these all these missions are 2,000. So I'm assuming, we'll let the, the, the sort of a time tick by to another month here. We click on this again. Um, I wonder if it says it somewhere on the screen what our raid points are. Yeah, okay, that, that went up. Hopefully it'll let us know when we are able to raid. Unemployment rate has gone up. So more people are coming to the island. But I guess our workplaces aren't being finished quickly enough. Coconut harvester. Cool. I like coconuts. And then we'll build a logging camp um, way back here. Steal Brandenburg Gate. Oh, it goes up with each tick. I don't have to wait for the month to go by. But still, we gotta wait for 2,000. And I'm hoping that we get a, an alert for it. I ask myself, Governor, do the ends justify being mean? Before in the do the ends justify being mean? Okay, 10 out of 10. I mean, they, they're, they're properly capturing the Tropican ludicrous dialogue. Because here's the thing. The developer of this game Okay, not the publisher, the publisher's Calypso. The developer of this game is Limbic Entertainment. Limbic Entertainment is known for, that's pretty much it. Um, they were not responsible for any of the previous Tropicos. Uh, they were responsible for Might and Magic Hero 7, uh, which sits at a whopping 68%, I think, Metacritic score. Um, and that's pretty much it, as far as I can tell. So, I mean, you know, on my, my, my quick little Googling and checking over here. So it's a good sign that they sort of properly captured this. It was a very good sign. Of course, um, Tropical 1 through 4 was by Hamamont Entertainment, uh, which uh, you may know more recently as being the publisher of Surviving, or the, the developer of Surviving Mars. So build library. Now the thing is, we already are nearly done the library, so that's gonna be perfectly fine. So we got some more, uh, uh, Swiss bank account and rum contribution. Mix says, unemployment in my Caribbean democracy? It's more likely than you might think. Well, the problem is there's just so many people that want to come to Tropico because Tropico is amazing. Now, what I could do is I could rush build a few more of these. That's probably a good idea. That's cheap. That's pretty cheap. Let's rush build these so we can start making more money from it right away and employ people as quickly as possible. Library is nearly done. Coconut Harvester here will quick build you as well. That's gonna be a-okay. Um, so you are complaining because you don't have anything. Empty stock. So we need Teamsters to come there. Revolution is as yet only marginally glorious. Marginally but glorious. With your continued support, Governor, the people will make it shine. We appreciate your help. We will work hard to improve the luster of our disobedience. <laughs> if the people keep polishing, we will one day be able to see our faces in this rebellion. Um, I'm not gonna take the immigrants right now. Well, you know what? Screw it. Unemployment doesn't matter. Again, this is not a, an actual goal. It's just a, a, a reminder that things could be better. Exclamation mark for the raid. Pirate Cove, no raid in progress. Letting know that we can do it. This is great. It's whiskey and chocolate. It's whiskey and chocolate. Hey, anyway, what? I'm gonna take this mission here to give us pineapples because we're gonna try to complete that mission a little bit sooner. More whiskey and chocolate. I mean, uh, Swiss bank account and rum. Oh, I shouldn't have gotten rum for today's stream. 
Thanks for your great videos. This is from a Delta Bravo Pro Productions. Been watching it for the past five years. Just about six, six and your starter videos really help. Uh, good job, keep it up. From a French Canadian, wee oui, wee, oui. merci beaucoup. Um, I really appreciate that. And it's nice to see people are still getting to Civ. Cause I wondered like, is it that everyone who would be into Civ has already bought Civ? But I do keep getting messages of people who have just picked up the game and it's like, excellent. We need more people playing more games like Civ because then they will keep making games like Civ. And that is a good thing. That is a wonderful thing that makes us extraordinarily happy. I'm not gonna take the emergence for your quill. <laughs> right, so the heist, hold on. So maybe what I'll do next time, instead of doing any of this, I'll save up 5,000 points. Why did we go negative? Did it double bill us? Because we had 2,000 and change. We did this, which costs us 2,000, and now we have negative points. Automatic screenshot, save. I gotta say, this beta reporting tool is pretty freaking impressive. Oh, hold on. I think they want it there. Did I not? Send. I I'm. I may have to submit a bug report for their bug report because these were optional, but I had to put something in there. <laughs> hey, Mini Snowman, thanks for the bits. The hat is dented, fix it. Yeah, it, this hat doesn't have a whole lot of structure, unfortunately. Yes, it's possible to move the palace. We get charged a slight fee, but otherwise we're okay. Hey, unemployment is fixed. So, let's see. This trade route we had going on, where's that? Over here. Okay, that's progressing nicely. So what we could do, we have a coal mine. Let's set up a second license. Uh, planks and leather. Oh, and we can trade to other people. Ooh, to the smugglers. 40% above. Wait, why is it red? Shouldn't it be like just turbo green? Why is it in red? I mean, it does piss off the crown to sell to smugglers. But dang, that's a lot of money. Import. Thank you. That makes sense all of a sudden. I didn't realize. So some of these are exports and some of these are imports. Oh, all right. I see the little flag now and then the word import over there. That makes so much more sense. Shellfish, that's new as a resource. Now, unfortunately, they won't want coal. They want gold, I don't know if we've got that. They will be happy to take rum. Okay, um, that's, that's an import as well. Here, let's set up some shellfish, because I'm assuming the Fisherman's Wharf. I'm hoping can get shellfish. As long as we don't keep too much of it for ourselves, because that would be shellfish. No, that doesn't work. Damn it. All right, we'll see what happens when we build those. Let's bring the speed up just times two. Well, you did the right thing. <gasps> Tropical Which means propaganda posters, and here's the first. <gasps> Esoteric fish, I'm excited. Cream tea? What is? Make sure to sleep when ordered, or you'll be sleeping with the fish. <laughs> Authorized by people ensuring total respect for authority. <laughs> uh, all right. Um, yeah, we'll take a mandate extension here for now. We don't know how much time we'll need to finish this. Um, 
we can we can do another pineapple export. Excellent. We'll keep doing that. Done. Yeah, there are green spots for the wharf, but I don't think we build the wharf on this. We place it on the beach, and based on based on how it used to work, they send out little fish or little boats to the nearest green spot. There we go. So, forefather style, each fisher produces blah fish for every one unit taken from the fishing ground. Drift netting is later. Supply local market. Output is decreased, but efficiency of each gourmet restaurant is increasing. Okay, these are not shellfish. Whiskey and chocolate from Cool Man! Hey! Thank you. Oh. You need fish farms? In the Cold War? To make shellfish? So, I can't possibly complete this. Unless I'm missing something, but... Alright, they want sugar. Let's go ahead and we'll start exporting sugar. So we can get sugar plantations down that we can later convert into some sort of, like, rummage. Uh, sugar, sugar, mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Uh, honey, honey. I know we don't have, like, full plot coverage on some of these. And it looks a little bit wonky. That's okay. Oh, this might hurt the coconut thing. There we go. Um, because we've got fewer palm trees. I ask myself, Governor, do the ends justify being mean? I do like that. Before do the ends justify being mean? Any sacrifice is worthwhile. Please make a sacrifice as well for the people. I uh, was just to produce some fish, which is fine because we're working on it. Something does not feel quite right, Governor. I have a powerful desire to call you Presidente. Hey! hey. Um, so we have revolutionary approval. We have support. Um, but we don't have any defenses, so are we gonna the suddenly get attacked? Of Portugal love you almost as much ah, as I there we do, go. Governor. We have such exquisite taste. So I don't have any troops, so we're not gonna declare independence and prepare for war. We're just gonna go and pay off the crown. We got the money for it, Excellent. it's gonna be fine. I knew you had a good head on your shoulders, and would want to keep it there. My heart swells with joy as I greet my fearless leader for the first time as El Presidente. El Presidente! Uh, but as hard as this period for a fledged nation to take flight from the colonial nest, it is a time of wars, and a sequel to wars. Time to fortify, to think about electri electrification and industry, and to train doctors to fi fix, fix the health problems caused by that industry. There's so much to be done. So, not capitalize, it probably should be. Uh, juggle relations with four political factions, side with one of two opposing superpowers, send commandos on raids to suppress guerrillas and covert ops. Okay. And we have to make our constitution! Oh. All citizens vote. Wealthy citizens vote. Open ballot elections. Employees of government buildings vote for El Presidente regardless of their approval. Those with an approval below 48% might turn rebel, with a chance of this increase by 10. Those ballot cast to determine position Presidente, such as being of such importance as sovereignty of the nation, Tropico shall be made a matter of public record, and thus available to scrutiny of all citizens, rather than being accessible solely ballot officers. Oh, so this is be... You, everyone knows who you voted for. Oh. And just the risk. They're the rich. Hey, lazy. I have no idea what you're talking about, lazy. Manually playing the patch. You're corrupt. Open ballots? Let's do open ballots. <laughs> uh, armed forces. Oh, of course. I mean, I'm always a pacifist. Whoa. That would disable all military buildings. Decreases the rebel threat buildup by 75%. Increases standing with all superpowers by five. Uh, militia, soldiers require no education. In case of military conflict, each barracks provides one militia squad or professional trainer, soldiers. Soldiers are required to have at least a high school education. They get, they do extra damage and the militarists are happy. Oh, there's an upgrade I could have gotten for the things I see now. People want professional soldiers. Okay, well, we're gonna have to get a high school up and running ASAP. 
So we're going to go ahead and con uh, confirm this uh, this constitution of Tropico as such as it is. Okay. Done. So if we went here and checked the upgrades, dr fishing dredge. In addition to fish, the workers harvest shellfish. Ah! All right, well, we'll go ahead and upgrade both of those. So that's what it was. It was missing an upgrade for those trade routes. So that's going to be fine. We got sugar going. Um, we got a broker. The broker. I guess I had another name once. But you know what names are good for? They're good for getting you arrested, Presidente. Well, that's not my game. My game would be business. Which business? Hey, what have you got? Let's talk real politic, Presidente. And by that, I mean how we make money before your people rise up and pose you. Or not. But let's be honest, we're both here to fill our Swiss bank accounts. And in the best case scenario, also not get caught. Not that the deals I'll be offering are in any way dubious. It'll uh, usually be obvious just how illegal they are. Nice to meet you, I guess. Do okay. any of these offers look good to you? They're all strictly legitimate. Of course, legitimacy is flexible, and it just means made legal. And you can make anything legal by having a contract. That doesn't mean you want Interpol to see the contract, of course. Maybe legitimate, but it still carry. It might still carry certain rather insignificant r risks. Oh, unlock the blueprint of the mansion that would otherwise cost five hundred. Oh, you pay for this out of your Swiss bank account. Why would I want to buy things with my Swiss bank account? It's my Swiss bank account. It's mine. And yeah, some of the voices are loud and some of them aren't. Let's see here what we can do. Voice volume set to 100%. And I guess I brought down the music because I was afraid of being flagged, but we'll give it a test. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring down the master volume Like that. I know this is gonna seem, no. Yeah, no, I'll just do this, it's fine. And I'll just bring up the game volume here. Just let me know if like the music and other sound effects get too loud. Like I want the voices to be boosted, but without being, without everything else being too crazy. Uh, we got more trade routes. Meat, we don't do shellfish, we can start doing. So we can trade to the allies, sure. And sugar to the allies. Yeah, we'll just we'll just be friends with the allies. I mean, sure, it's fine, right? Um, if we take a look at our almanac, where's our politics? So our current factions are capitalist, communists, religious, and militarists. And our Ferengi relations, there's the Axis and the Allies. Okay. I gotta say this this almanac. This is possibly the best almanac to date in a tropical game. This is very good. This is very good. How can anything be illegal when you make laws? It's true. Well, I think it's in, under, uh, it's against um, international laws, is more or less what they're saying. Okay, um, so research. Okay, we can just queue all this stuff, which is fine. We have the library. Um, all right, just queue a bunch of stuff. So we have you. Let's get an academic department. We have workers. Media and education, there's our high school. We have to unlock the blueprint. How much money do we have? Uh, none. All right, good. So we have to wait. El Presidente announces a new snitch for cash program. Report something suspicious today and you could win fabulous cash prizes. So we're still doing a raid. It takes a long time to do, apparently. I think you will be, still be able to do pirate missions even in the later eras. So you think the in-game music might be a little high. Okay. We'll bring it down there. Okay. Is that Juanito? So, um... Money might be a bit of an issue. Everyone loves me, which is good. I don't know about our financial situation. Allies sending foreign aid. Thank you very much. Um, are there mining upgrades? There are for Pout Cannery. 
Oh, Canary! Decreases the risk of this building catching fire. Adds extra job positions. It's here, whiskey we'll do and that. chocolate! So we can have more people working there. It's Mick! Let's hey! It. You it's can't break international laws I if you don't let internationals into investigate. I like that. Now, I'm going to take off my hat because it's well, sort of like digging into my forehead a little bit. You can see, like, the big red mark. Oof. 